Okay, so here are my latest Motion Potion ingredients put within my mix. Okay, all these things, Lion's Mane. And this over here is Irish Sea Moss. The, it doesn't say it in the label like up here where it should, but it says it down here real tiny. Uh, mega Mushrooms. So you got Lion's Mane. Mega Mushrooms has Lion's Mane in it. Lion's Mane is good for the brain. Feet Organic Powder. And lastly... Cascara Sagrada. Um, I did actually also put, I just remembered, I couldn't find my big milk thistle, but thank God I still had some in here. So I put some milk thistle. I put some chopped uh, raw pepitas. Now they say that it gets stale if you chop them, you have them chopped for a while. Oh, uh, they say that about, sorry. Flaxseed, flaxseed. I put flaxseed, okay? So they say, say I emptied it out. They say it gets stale. Frankly, it still works. I don't know what what's up with that, that, that they get stale, that you got to chop it, freshly chop it. I mean, they do say that about everything. You should, uh, Powder does go bad faster than before it's in big pieces, I guess. But I never had stale, uh, stale. Um, it always works. The flaxseed... If it's powder and sitting there for ages and I use it, it works. Okay, so I don't know what they're talking about. You know, everybody wants to know everything. Uh, as far as I'm concerned, it works. And that's all I care. All right, so these are all the things that I put in it. Okay, so I'm going to eliminate one by one. Remember, over here is Irish sea moss. Okay, root beet. Okay. Well, look at that. Something calcified down here. You see that? But it wasn't the moringa. Some, there was powder down here somewhere. But the moringa is okay. It's soft. But this is what happens to, pow to, to a lot of the powders. Especially beet. I think they're putting preservatives on it. That, you know, that it doesn't get hard. Uh, so let me pause this. Well, I guess I wasn't recording all this time. I don't I don't get this camera. I mean, now i got to put everything back and show everything back because I, I don't trust this darn camera. I mean, what on earth? Okay. I put beet juice. Irish sea moss. Cascara sagrada. Organic mushrooms, which has lion's mane, but I also added an extra dose of lion's mane. Less of thin powder, which is very good for you. Uh, morning moringa. I didn't have everything here last time. I, I add whatever I have. And here is fast fermented soybean powder. Okay. You don't use a lot of that. MSN. Hopefully the mixing of these things is not a big deal. Because frankly, I don't have time to start reading and see what could be mixed, what can't be mixed. A lot of doctors themselves don't even know it because I've watched programs of doctors that say it, yet other doctors tell you to go ahead and mix it. So uh, the chemistry of these things being mixed is not guaranteed, uh, but hey, I, I'm only doing what I can, right? Not a doctor or a nurse. Raw pepitas. Um, what I do is I powder them. So mine were powdered already a week ago. And they say don't use powder stuff. It goes back fast. It goes stale. Well, it always still works for me. That's all I got to say. Milk thistle. I already emptied this jar. Now I have to find the bag because it keeps getting lost. I don't get it. Where on earth does the milk thistle keep going to? Milk thistle is very good for uh, liver cleansing. And I have a fatty liver. Very good and very much needed. MSN. And this was filled with mold flaxseed oil and they say oh it shouldn't be mold because you know uh it goes bad goes rancid no it doesn't i i've used flaxseed that's been molded and sitting there for a long time i take it and it works so i you know i mean we're, we're not back at the farm we're, we're not growing this stuff you know we're in the city and so that's it oh i did put i think i put a little bit 
of black seed uh, cumin seed powder. Typically, people don't don't really ingest this, but it, I mean, it is used for cooking, so I'm wrong. I mean, I do take black seed oil, and let me show you that. Okay, and I've started mixing this powder with uh, hemp oil. That's very expensive, very good from a great farmer, and. It do, it's not as strong as this, so that tells me I need to put more of this powder in my bottle. Um, th I don't see uh, granuled powder in here at all. Um, so it's very possible that the oil is from black, black seed. I don't know. But you could mix it. I mean, that's another way to do it. And, uh, bottom line, you're, you're, you're trying to get the benefits of black cumin seed powder, which is black seed, black seed what's used for black seed oil. Okay, this is it. Thank you so much and have a great day.